everyone and welcome to our 340 writing workbook tutorial. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you where to find and how to use the 340 writing workbook. So what is the 340 writing workbook? Well, simply it's a Google slide presentation where you will be collecting and presenting your weekly writing assignments. And it's also a place for your teacher to look at those assignments and give you feedback. So where do we find this amazing writing workbook? It's quite easy. It's going to be here in your Google Classroom. So when you go into classwork, it's gonna be one of the top assignments in your classwork stream. When you view that assignment, it's gonna be here under your work. And when you click that, it is going to make a copy of your writing workbook for you. That's it, and now you have it. So this is gonna be your writing workbook where each week you're going to be uploading pictures or typing in answers. Also, your teacher will be able to come and see what you are doing and leave you some comments and feedback. Easy, right? So now let's look at the two main things you will be doing in your writing workbook. So in your workbook, you're going to see, um, like I said, two main tasks or actions that you can do. One is click to add text, and another is insert a screenshot or insert an image. So anywhere you see click to add text, of course, that means you can click and add text. Easy. So the first thing you're gonna do on your title slide is add your name, ID number, and section number, and then you're done. And then you'll see here for each week, you have a variety of different slides with different tasks and different actions you can do. The most common action we're gonna ask you to do is insert a screenshot of Google Form score here. So throughout 340, you are going to be doing most of your lessons in Google Forms. And you're gonna find those Google Forms in your weekly assignment packages that you're going to find in your Google Classroom. So for the writing weekly assignment packages, you're going to have grammar, writing part one and writing part two lessons. And in these, you're going to have between two to five Google Form lessons. So all you need to do is come here and click to open that Google Form and the lesson. And so you're gonna go in, you're gonna answer the questions, you're gonna watch the videos, you're gonna do the activities, and when you finish, you're going to find this screen that has your score. And this is what we want you to upload into your writing workbook. So you're gonna to wanna to take a screenshot of just this top part here that has the title of the Google form, your score, and your email address. And once you take that screenshot, you're gonna come back to your writing workbook. Again, it's in your Google Drive and your Google Classroom. You're gonna to go to the correct slide. You're gonna find the place to insert that image and you're going to replace the image. That keeps all of the formatting on the page correct. So you're gonna replace the image. I'm going to upload from my computer. If you're on a tablet or a phone, it's going to say upload from camera. Um, or wherever it is that you put that screenshot. So now I have that image. And for each of these different lessons, again, that's here in my weekly writing assignment package, I'm going to upload a screenshot. So most of our lessons, like I said, are in Google Forms. And most of them, you're just going to need to upload a picture of the score at the end of that form. But some of our assignments are going to tell us to go to a specific slide to continue the lesson after we've watched all of the videos, either in the Google form or in the workbook. I'll show you that in a second. 
So after I finish this lesson, it's going to tell me to go into writing workbook slide four and type in a little paragraph. So then I'm gonna come here to slide four, and again, it tells me click to add text. So again, all of those um, instructions are here in my weekly writing assignment package. And again, most of my lessons are in Google form. However, some weeks, for example, in week three, this is my week three writing assignment package, it will tell me to go directly to the writing workbook. There is no Google form for this week. So if I go to slide seven, here I find all of my video lessons for that second part of my essay writing assignment for the week. So I'm just going to, here in my writing workbook, watch that video. All right, hi guys. <laughs> and then complete the different assignments. Again, the instructions are in the videos. So that's it for the writing workbook. Once you've uploaded your screenshot or typed in your answer to those questions, your teacher will be able to see it in Google Classroom and give you comments and suggestions and feedback on your work. And you can share it and improve and become an amazing writer at this semester of 340. So hopefully that answered some of your questions about how to use the writing workbook. If you still have questions or problems, please talk to your teacher. We are here to help you because we want to be sure that you become an amazing writer and have great grammar as well. So without anything else to say, let's get started writing.